Hello there. Uh, my name is Mr. Eric or Mr. Callaghan. I work at the high school. Um, and I was talking to Mr. Conway the other day about this really cool uh, VR 3D modeling program that I, I told him I would uh, just briefly show you guys. It's called Adobe Medium. Uh, right now I'm working off of my uh, VR enabled uh, PC and I have my link cable plugged into my MetaQuest 2 or Oculus Quest 2. Um, so I'm just going to quickly run through some of these tools just because I, I find this to be sort of a better modeling style than um, than um, traditional modeling. So uh, you've got your clay tool here. Uh, you can select different colors uh, for whatever you want to to model. You can actually do um, all your RGB values. Um, it's it's pretty cool. Lots of different stuff. You can use the eyedropper tool to pick up a uh, different color from uh, something that you've already modeled. In here, you can pick out different stamps and all sorts of different stuff. This is just introductory, so I'm not going to go through all of these things. I'm just showing you what they are here. So you've got bones. Um, you know, if you wanted to model a gorilla head, you've got the stamp now selected. And then I could go back out here. I can make a giant. Um, there you go. Blue gorilla skull and then if I wanted to let's say I wanted to go back on this and uh, do some some muscles and things like that I could go back in here I could do a normal round shape I can move my model around and um, then I can go in here and add a little muscles yeah, I don't know. Stuff like that. Um, I can increase my resolution for the file here. And then I can get a lot more detailed with the things I'm adding in here. You can make whatever you like. And it's just a much more nice way of 3D modeling, I, I find. I make something silly like that. You can even scroll through your timeline here and delete everything, or you can go back through. Um, yeah, I find it very interesting. Uh, I'll pull in quickly one other model here that I'd like to show you. I have, um, I took 3D scans of Paul, uh, Paul and Babe. I'll load that in here. Nope. So I actually used my phone. I went down to Paul and Babe and I scanned images from the ground and uploaded it into uh, an app called Kiri Engine. K I R I um, Engine. And um, it came out with a 3D model of uh, Paul and Babe down there at uh, the waterfront. So I can scale this. I can do whatever I want to. Some of the um, meshes for Paul came in where, like you can see here, there's no actual pipe there connecting it. So I could, you know, if I wanted to go in and fix this, I could. Make something like that. It's not very beautiful. I would probably use a um, different tool boom now he's got a giant tongue <laughs> so uh, yeah so these are just some uh, kind of interesting tools for 3d modeling that I thought you might enjoy